want to say a big shout out and thank you to Team 17 for sponsoring today's video. Classified France 44 releases on March 5th on Steam, PlayStation 5, and Xbox Series XS. Basically, this game is a turn-based tactical espionage and combat game set in the run-up to D-Day. I'm going to be leading an elite team of soldiers in today's mission, and you can do the same and lead your resistance fighters to victory against the German occupation forces during World War II. So let me show you a little bit about how the gameplay flows. I've got four French freedom fighters inside of a German U-boat pen during World War II. This is the resistance. And my mission is to plant three explosives on this U-boat and destroy it. The problem is, well, there's a lot of guards. So I'm gonna have to use a mix of like tactics and brain power, a little bit of sneaking around and a whole lot of shooty shooting at these guys. The first thing we need to do, I'm thinking is unlock this door and gain access to this room. We know that there's a few guards over here Presumably guards back here and definitely three guards right here. Now we've got something called hip fire because of my four agents, two of them are armed with shotguns, one with the semi-auto sniper and the other one with the submachine gun. Oh, the shotgun's gonna be able to take out two guys at the same time. That is fantastic. The only thing I wish we could do is sneakily take out this guy, but he seems too far away. Wait a minute. He's covered in foliage and he's got a knife icon. I think this guy's like a German commando. He's gonna be tough to take out, but I think we can do it. So I think the play here is moving our submachine gunner into position and our sniper into position. And uh, well, I guess hoping for the best. Now we don't really know what's up here other than this guard. Maybe I can move with just enough points left to go into Overwatch or actually I might even be able to shoot at them. Yeah, I could get some shots off at this private. Okay, so first things first, these two guys need to go. We were able to take both of them out in one shot and oh, and some explosives went off. Okay, so now this commando needs to die, but the whole base has effectively been alerted to us. So time to take them all out. Ooh, this sniping shot is gonna do quite a bit of damage. Oh my, well, there we go. We were planning on having to use our second guy, but I guess we could move into like a hard defensive spot. Probably be the smartest thing to do. And we'll go into Overwatch. Not that anyone's gonna come into this relatively limited field of fire, but we're ready for it. And we'll take some shots around the corner with the shotgun and we stun the guy. I mean, you'd be stunned too if you took buckshot straight to the teeth. All right, so this guy moves straight up in here and I'll... They hit me. He got some shots off on one of our guys. This is gonna oh, be no, quite the logistics. Oh wait, we got a medic? That is illegal. I need to get into a spot where I can go into Overwatch. The sniper needs to go into Overwatch. Who's that? A Panzer Grenadier Scout, and this guy's a pennant. Oh, Panzer Grenadier Heavy seems kind of scary. Wait a minute. I have a grenade. Oh, I could hit them both. Okay, I'd really like to do that. If we do this right. Actually, I might only have to use one. Let's see if this works. I also have a sticky bomb. Could I stick that right on them? Because that would be hilarious. But the high explosive fragmentation grenade seems to do more. Grenade! All right. In deco, pin down. So there's Dango. one grenade out. We're going for a little two for one special here. The there it is. That's two soldiers down. Yes! No, those were two of their best troops because their pens are grenadiers. Now, the issue here... Wait a minute, you know what? I mean, if it, if it works once, can it work again? <laughs> yes! I can take two guys out with another grenade! You can't heal anybody if your medic just got blown up by a grenade. That's just arithmetic. Now, this guy needs to go. Can we, can we slashy slash? All right, this is a shotgun. I think I need to like just run straight up to him. Yep. We're gonna move here and just blast him point blank. Ready? Surprise! <laughs> Can't miss when you. Oh gosh. Okay, so. Oh. Okay, never mind. That's just like a basic navy guy. That's a medic. Oh shoot! I didn't account for this troop. Okay, it's just another medic guy with a bolt action. We may have dealt with most of the heavy opposition. Wait, I'm hearing more feet. All right, they're taking shots, and I thought I was behind decent cover, but it looks like not good enough. There's an explosive barrel, and I'm not sure how much it would explode. 
What is number five? It's playing a trumpet. Rally. Oh, that increases morale. That's cool. But we, we don't need to play a trumpet. We need to shoot some guns. I guess there are some barrels around here. That's what happens when you fight in, like, an ammo dump. All right. We've got our shotgun here. One more shot. I move. Should do it. Yep. Go play. Goodbye. All right, now everybody needs to reload. And if you have action points, we're putting you on Overwatch, which actually doesn't cover much. So she has seven. I can actually move her here. There we go. That's a much better field of cover. So this guy's protected. I have a 70% hit chance. I would love to get closer and make that like a 100. So we're going to do that. Moving. Oh my goodness, that that's dangerous. What if I did a sticky bomb? I would take out the guy that's my biggest threat of shooting me back. Or could I just shoot him with my gun? 69% chance is a is a good. Wait a minute. If I shoot at this, I could actually have a chance to spray everything. Let's destroy the fuel barrel. And hope we get a little bit lucky. Hey, we got the other guy and we suppressed the one that was hiding behind the wall. I'm gonna call that a win. Now with this guy, can we? I don't have the shot on the other one. So... Little snipey snipe. He's not dead? Biscuits and gravy, that man's strong. Okay, <laughs> listen, this is what strategy is. I lured the medic into a trap. It's it's all part of the plan, guys. Oh my god, there's so many of them. And this guy's getting absolutely wrecked. Okay, I'm gonna have to pull them back, and these guys are gonna have to go up and save the day, flanking hard in from this side. But who's gonna have the action? There we go. We have the shotgun ready. I've got a 93% chance. I'm taking it. Little blasty blast. Critical shot? Oh, that was a two for one special once again. You need your morale to get better? Throw a sticky grenade on a dude and laugh. Frag out! That's cleaned up the yard. Yeah. That was fan freaking tastic. Now, do you have the movement to get out of there. No. All right, I really need to make sure this guy stays alive. So we're just gonna have to plan for the next turn. You know what? Here we go. This guy peeks his head up. He's sight. getting Gavard 43. Wait a minute. Are those like reinforcements coming in? I, have a target. I think we're gonna have to, yeah, yeah. Okay, take the shot. The shot. Ah! Excellent. You plant the other one back Moving here. Out. And look at this U-boat, man. Is this is the U-boat we're trying to scuttle in its impressive and near impregnable U-boat pen, which the Germans were renowned for. All right, that sector's largely secured. Open the blast I'm doors. No Wait a minute. I don't know where the blast doors are. That's probably, yep, that's an engine that controls this chain, which controls this winch, which controls the blast doors. All right, that's where we gotta go. So here's a question. Can I pistol that thing from here? Nope. Oh. Yes, I can. I mean, it's pretty. It should be an easy shot. Take the shot. So that's a secondary objective: destroy the fuel canisters. Cause you're pr you're not doing too hot. I guess we could increase the morale of this guy. Might as well do it. Unwavering conviction. That's what that's what we like to see around here. All right, it's the enemy's turn. Let's see what happens. Okay, there's two guys here. We should have grenade. Oh, three guys. A three for one special is just something. How do we get this grenade off? That, I don't know who's over there, but they're not gonna have a good time. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's two. Oh, one of them was a commando. That's three. That's a hat trick. Get wrecked, Jerry. Oh wait. Oh, this is, this isn't. This isn't a pickup. This is me planning satchel charges. Let's out? go get that med kit. Now we're, we're out in the open, granted, Thanks. but all right. I kind of want to plant this explosive. A reload costs five action points. I feel like we can take this a little bit slower. So we'll move Blowing up out. to hard cover, Loading. reload the sniper. Rifle. I guess what we could do is cover. Because why not? Because why not? Oh, maybe that's one enemy in a turn. Uh-oh. Well, we sent a soldier out to cover. Uh, we know what we're doing. She's low on ammo. All right. We're out of the radius of that explosive. All right, let's go plant this explosive. Oh, we've got to get out. Kill enemies with explosives. One more enemy with an explosive? Wait, tell me you got one. I think you're just out of action points. 
All right, that's everybody this turn. Okay. Ye Whoa, I thought that was one enemy. That was just Stop the number it. of turns. Okay, that's a commando. And this guy just bomb rushed me. This is bad. We gotta get out of the blast radius and get these doors open. Okay, so you need to run like all the way down here. All right, we're looking pretty, that has to be it. Moving yeah, it's got, it's got the number one objective over it. I feel terrible, but they didn't say that what everybody has want? to escape alive, right? And I want to get that secondary objective of killing enemies with explosives. But at the same time, that's just that's just messed up. I, I, I can't do it. I was just kidding you guys. All right, so that costs three action points. This guy's got 14. We can retreat and then plop the grenade on this guy. This is going to be a running retreat. Bravely, bravely, bravely running away. Get wrecked, you Jerry. And all secondary objectives have been completed. Now we just got to get the primary one. Because there are actually three Jerry's probably going to be spawning in down below. Yep, like right here. <laughs> we got the one guy with the submachine gun just like running at the very end of the group. Oh shoot, this is going to be tough actually. Yeah, that's a, that's a lot. If we had a grenade ready, we could go for it. But like, oh. Woo! That's the advantage of hard cover. I wish I could lay booby traps for them. That would be awesome. I got to worry about you. You got to get out of here. We'll take the cover I move. and run. This might actually work without any casualties. Crazy, right? Oh, cool. Like, this is the officer's room over here. Who's on this poster? Hello there, it is me. We're sinking, we're sinking. And then you're like, well, what are you sinking about? Oh, we are so freaking close. I guess he, mm, there's just too many of them, you know? I'm up now. Oh. Hey! That's a pretty efficient scuttling right there. Holes in the side of a U-boat. You don't want to be undersea booting it if your boot that's undersea's got holes in it. All right, this this is an old German saying. I swear, don't don't Google that. Yeah, there's a bunch of guys popping up back there. There's a lot of activity in the fog of war. But you will never get me. Oh my goodness, we gotta get out of here. All right, let's open these Moving blast doors. Out. Oh, that's my little escape boat. Look at that. I don't know who snuck in. Oh, it's it's got a German insignia on it. All right, so we're just making the most of the environment. That's that's part of being a commando. So now at this point, he's got seven action points. So I guess Moving. what we could do is do a little covery cover. Oh, you can make it, Bob. You're gonna do some cover and fire, and since you're a sniper, you can cover Checking a lot. Sector. And you got the shotgun, so you're just gonna I'm chill. I guess you'll heal up. All right, <laughs> we have one agent to extract. And the enemy is closing in. You can hear them mobilizing in high numbers. I guess it's part of being a spy. You gotta get out of there. All right, come on. Come on, <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Like, what if a boat just flew in the entrance and was like, ha ha, surprise! And then we died. That'd be, that'd be sad. All aboard, mission completed, and give me those five stars. Sabotage and create the escape route. We did everything that we had to do and we did it only in 12 turns. Now, if you get classified France 44, play that mission and see if you can do it better. You can use the link in the video description below to find out more about the game and get it for yourself. And a big shout out and thank you to Team 17 for sponsoring today's video.